Hi, this is Trey Pass. I'm going to do a reaction review of Titans, uh, Season 3, Episode 6, I believe. Yes, this is Episode 6. <laughs> I was doubting it for a minute, but Episode 6. I'm um, loving this season so far, so let's see what this one's all about, and I'll be right back with my reaction. Okay, let me put my headphones in. Okay, here we go right now. Go. What the hell is that? Music. Then he'll see us. <laughs> and I'll resign. Hmm. There you are, honey. One Earl Grey. Hmm. Hmm. I know it's not a ring, but... <laughs> Happy anniversary. Hmm. Uh oh Uh-oh. Oh, man. Whoa! Shoot! Jesus. Drop your knife. Oh. Whoa. Oh man, now <laughs> go to F home, huh? Jesus. I would never burn down your home. Mm. It's so <laughs> quaint. <laughs> I said don't touch anything. <laughs> hey. You're back. <laughs> Have him washed immediately and return to my chair. Ah. What? Yeah, what? <laughs> Tamarin is a very different planet. Mm -hmm. Clearly the strapping one is my manservant. Ah. Here to attend to my needs. <laughs> sure, I can attend to your needs. Ah. That's what she's talking about. No, 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 no. We don't do that. <laughs> Connor is not your shoe toy. <laughs> Where would that be? No one's going to tell you about. <laughs> Upstairs, pick a room. Ah! Ah! <laughs> Wherever Blackfire goes, chaos always follows. Mm. Mm. Six years ago, Gotham City, of course. Mm -hmm. Ha <laughs> ha. Robin. Shot. Mm. Drop the vase. Mm. If you wish. Mm. <laughs> nope. Ha <laughs> ha. You're not running? Mm -hmm. Maybe I want to get caught. <laughs> ah. <laughs> Marpa? <laughs> Security here is a joke. Mm -hmm. All right. Here we go. <laughs> <coughs> <coughs> it's stronger than it looks. Mm. <laughs> when you look at me, what do you see? Um, you see Commissioner Gordon's daughter. It's not what I was going to say. <laughs> Why not? It's all anybody ever sees. Mm. I'm the perfect daughter. I've got the test scores, the pedigree. Mm. Why don't you join me and Bruce? Mm. You're halfway there. He could teach mm. you. <laughs> Batman, Robin, and... Robin girl. Mm. <laughs> what? Mm. How about Batgirl? <laughs> Robin Girl has a nicer room. Uh, you ready to break some rules? <laughs> oh, yeah. Bastion leads a series of high-tech robberies that swept across Gotham's museums and galleries, 
several of the city's most prized works of art, artifacts, and world famous jewels have vanished under the cover of night. Mm. The systems can be perfectly smart. Mm. What are you going to do with all this? Maybe we should give it back. Mm. What? <laughs> no. Let's try it on. Mm -hmm. It really suits you. Yeah. Oh. Here. Tighter? Yeah. Oh, boy. Present day. Uh oh. What the hell? Dude, that looks horrible. Mm -hmm. Five inches over, and we'd be burying another body. Mm. Barbara's responsible for this? One of her snipers is, yeah. Mm. On her orders, I'm sure. Mm -hmm. Maybe I should go and have a word. <laughs> oh, bullshit, <laughs> Grayson. <laughs> Excuse me? Dude, Hank blew up. <laughs> Dawn left us forever, and Jason went dark. <laughs> this family is dying, and you go out alone and get yourself shot? <laughs> oh, Jesus. Do you even hear the words coming out of your mouth? What? <laughs> Where are you going? I'm gonna go find him. <laughs> you lost a lot of blood. You need to take it easy. <laughs> I'm right. Mm. Can you have me a knife? Mm. Are you sure? <laughs> Didn't my sister tell you I'm dangerous? <laughs> nice throw. <laughs> <laughs> Let's eat. <laughs> Yeah. You should too. Mm. Why? It works. I'm exhibit one. Mm. Exhibit A. Mm. Something submitted as primary evidence in support of a proposition or argument. Mm. Exactly. God, I exhibited the fuck out of it. <laughs> so let's step it up. There's a greater plan at work, Padawan Learner. Mm. Mysteries to be revealed. There's no plan without my okay. Mm -hmm. There's something I want to show you that I might shed some light on things. Mm. Mm. Uh huh. Hmm. Well, hang a second. There's been a, a shift in dynamics, and I blame myself for not being more transparent. Mm. About what? Exhibit B. Or as a lesser man may say, number two. Whoa! Whoa! Jesus! Jesus! Hmm. Jesus. He's scared. Good talk. Oh, man. The hell? This is a disgrace. We are queen. <laughs> 24 hours ago, you were a prisoner. <laughs> I think this is a major step up. <laughs> Freedom means nothing if you choose to live like a servant. <laughs> okay, let's get something straight. These people are my friends. Yeah. Queen. There's been a development in... <laughs> oh. No, we had a guest. <laughs> yeah, it's the thing I wanted to talk to you about. Blackfire. <laughs> Pleasure's yours. <laughs> Blackfire, you're... Yes. The person who killed your boyfriend. 
And your parents? Mm -hmm. In our kitchen. Mm -hmm. The surgical team was killed and a piece of medical equipment went missing. Mm -hmm. They found a drug inhaler at the crime scene. Let's go. Mm -hmm. You just got shot. Mm -hmm. Bruce got shot all the time. Mm -hmm. Didn't stop him. Look how well that went. Mm -hmm. Then I guess I'll just have to do better. Mm -hmm. Let's go. Yeah, let's go. I understand now. Mm -hmm. The tiny green one isn't your man's servant. <laughs> Clearly, he satisfies your urges. <laughs> you still angry at me? Scar? Oh, it's fear disguised as anger. Mm -hmm. He's just worried about you. He doesn't want you to get hurt. Mm. Well, it's part of the job. Yeah, well, most people are scared by that. Mm. You're just not like most people. <laughs> yeah, Bruce Wayne to thank for that. Mm -hmm. And now Crane is doing the same thing to chase them. Mm. How'd you know? You're not allowed access. Mm. On whose orders? Of course. Of course. Mm. So that partnership seems to be off to a <laughs> great start. The Crane, Jason, and now this new killer, we cannot track them down with one hand mm. to hide behind our back. Good point. You and Barbara, fix it. <laughs> Good point. <laughs> mm. Yeah, I'll take care of it. Mm. You gonna shoot me again? <laughs> this is more your range. <laughs> How bad? It looks worse than it is. Went clean through. Mm. Thanks to you, I've got a high-value prisoner on the loose. Mm. And the BOP gunning for my resignation. Mm. So, before you start. Okay, just... We, we both made some mistakes yesterday. Mm. Are you apologizing? <laughs> I'm explaining. I had a strong hunch about Crane. I came here because we need to start working together. Mm. Right, because history shows that we worked great together. <laughs> We gotta be on the same side here because if we're not, this whole I know. city. I get it. The killer disabled though our video feed. Mm. We were only able to recover the audio, which is useless. So, unless you have any other ideas. I have one idea. Mm. Don't say it. Oracle. Mm. Is that what this routine's all been about? <laughs> this is Red Hood and Scarecrow. Mm. We can use Oracle's voice recognition to tap into Gotham's phone network. Mm. They think they're above the law. Kidnapping prisoners, using them as bait. Mm. Okay, fair enough. How can I help? Mm. You really want to help? Yeah. Go home. It's a shortwave positron multiplier. Mm. Which is what? I don't know. It sounds super impressive. <laughs> need to figure out what Crane wants with it. Ugh. Something to add? Mm -hmm. Yes, sister. The source is on the street. Mm. Or maybe you're more comfortable taking orders from others mm. rather than taking the initiative yourself. Mm. Oh, boy. Corey. <laughs> <laughs> Worst taste in music ever. <laughs> I see some things never change. And I can't kill you. Mm. So that leaves us here. Mm. Stay in the car. Mm. You watch her. Mm -hmm. Oh boy. There you go. Mm. Nice. Ah! Car, so naive. I thought your idea was good. Mm -hmm. About getting intel from the people on the street. Why are you sitting next to me? <laughs> I could use the company. <laughs> No open skies, no flowing water. Mm. The very air burns your skin. Mm. I miss that burn. Mm. Why would you miss that? We made life prosper from nothing but dust. Mm. Wait, how did you know? <laughs> I can see the strength of Krypton running in your blood. Ah! And something else. Mm. The Lex part. I'm uh, half Kryptonian and half human. Mm. 
fire. Mm. Every royal is born with it except me. Mm. The cursed child. Mm. I was treated as less than a worm. Mm. The Titans took me in. Maybe they could take you in too. Mm. We're a family. Mm. A family that doesn't share blood? Mm. <laughs> They've got my back. Mm. No matter what. Mm. You have to earn your way into this family. Mm. Oh. Oh. Hold on! Mm. 31 beats, what do we do? Make a deactivator. No one's gonna die this time. Mm. Mm. That's super boy over there. Oh man. 45? Jesus. 20. Whoa. Whoa, Jesus. Can you elaborate? <laughs> sure. Uh, the shortwave positron multiplier is used to cure kids with RPPD. It can multiply most any chemical compound with pulses of high energy positrons, resulting in oxidative reactions in the pentose phosphate pathway. I guess I could alter the machine to multiply other chemicals. Whatever I wanted more of, I could have, and fast. So whatever Crane was doing before he went into Arkham, he's back at it again. But up to what? What's he trying to make? Don't ask More fear gas. Oh, oh, she's gone. Now I get in the car. 25 meters. Mm -hmm. 25 meters. Do we go left or straight? Mm -hmm. Left. Mm -hmm. Does Barbara know you're in there? Mm -hmm. We're at a bit of an impasse. Mm -hmm. Once we get the uh, audio tapes from the hospital, I'll, I'll let her know. Dick, I gotta ask. Back at the cabin. Mm. What about it? Were you going to kill Jason? <laughs> what makes you say that? Mm. Batman went off on his own and killed the Joker. Mm. I just... I just don't understand. Why did he go bad? Mm. He had a tough life. That's what Bruce looked for. Mm. Someone with anger. Mm. What if this is not his fault? You kill Hank. What if it is? We don't know. Gotcha. Mm -hmm. No comment. Mm -hmm. Oh. Long went off. Finished yet? All, all we have is a skinny batch. Then give me that bed. All of it. We've been taking orders from Crane. We, we thought he was the boss. Hmm. Who's the boss again? Hmm. Yeah. We have audio from the murders, but no visual. Bruce and I used to do this together. Hmm. Part of my training. Hmm. Join me. Hmm. Brutal. across the back our killer has the ability to kill quickly but likes to savor the victim's pain mm. sounds personal mm. okay one more time 16 inch blade reverse grip splash mm. whoa Severed the Achilles tendon. Mm. Now pivot, knee spin, slice. Go. Whoa. Good work. Mm -hmm. Six years ago. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> 
Mm. Some sugar. It's a very intricate security system. <laughs> One requiring two people. Yeah. I have been thinking. Oh shit, you gotta be kidding me. Uh. It's him again. Fuck that man. <laughs> Don't go home now. You said two keypads? Yeah. Mm. He wants revenge, present day. Pick up, pick up. Oh. Uh oh. Dick, take a hint. Sir, take a hint. Barbara. Don't tell Dick. Don't tell Dick. Psych. Oh, shit. Sucker, see? Got played, yep. Drop your weapon. I'm moving. This was worth the wait. Mm. Mm. There you go. Oh. Whoa. Back up. Mm. Should have fired anyway. Jeez. Shit. Check the back computer for homicide. <laughs> Wait, you don't think Black Fire has actually killed people, do you? I don't know. Mm. Was on the wrong side of the track. <laughs> where you should have been. Mm. I went to some bars, cracked some skulls, <laughs> and found out from the rats of Gotham that Crane is in bed with the mob. Mm. But there is one unhappy mobster. Mm. That's our lead. Mm. You're a liar. Have been since we were kids. Mm. And that's worked just great for you, hasn't mm. it? The fuck is that supposed to mean? Mm. Face it. In order for you to be the good sister, I have to be the bad one. Mm. Yeah. For six years, Lady Vic leaves you alone, and now all of a sudden she wants her pound of flesh? Mm. This is about you and I working together again in Gotham. Mm. Or it's just about Gotham being Gotham. Mm. Doesn't have anything to do with us. Well, why now? I mean, Crane has read it for his dirty mm. words. <clears throat> Thank you. She wanted you dead, Barbara. Hmm. Just let me quickly check her apartment. Hmm. Okay. It really suits you. Tighter? Memories. Tension. All clear. Mm. A lot of tension. I guess that's it. I think you're good. Mm -hmm. Mm. <laughs> you okay? <laughs> yeah, I'm good. It's late. All right. Hey, this. Uh, come on. Well, then I'll um, see you tomorrow. Mm. Good night. Lock up. Always. <laughs> well, 
Is the bitch dead? The bitch still has moves. Mm -hmm. I had to skedaddle. Mm -hmm. Well, as long as you delivered the goods, then you will get another shot of her record. Mm -hmm. Flash photography. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I'll add another skill to the resume. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Fuck you, Crane. Mm -hmm. Jesus. Man, your shift started an hour ago. Where the hell are you? Yeah, priorities. The girls' parents are out of town. Oh, Tim Drake. Seriously? Jesus. Uh-oh. Hey, hold on. Hey. Okay. Hmm. <sighs> ah. Hmm. Ha <laughs> ha. your head. Anyway, uh, another good episode. Now at least we got more of the Titans interacting with each other. <laughs> anyway, a lot of things happened in this episode. We got to see, you know, little Barber and Dick bonding, uh, which is good. And see how they met. He met when he was Robin. <laughs> Okay, and they, you know, they had good chemistry. And again, Savannah Welch, I think she did really particularly good in this episode. We got to actually see her, I guess, use her prosthetic and move around and stuff and stuff. And we got to see her, again, interact with uh, Dick Grayson and stuff. And they have good chemistry. And I thought, again, you know, that scene at the end, you know, the tension between the two of them. I thought they were going to fall into bed again. But, you know, he, he, uh, he, yeah, he... <laughs> Uh, that that scene was played w very well, and then we got to see, of course, Corey interacting with her sister and with actually Superboy, and Gar. Okay, and we see Gar got really angry, and see, he, he, he saw he um at Dick for going on, you know, on his own to try to capture Red Hood and almost dying, and um, you see, he started to change into an animal. So I wonder if they are going to revisit that and and do have him change into a different animal, and then we see we got to see. Uh, Blackfire and uh, Connor Bond in the back of the car there. That was good. That she could sense that he was part Kryptonian and stuff. That was good. And they got to Bond and she was telling him about her family and how she wished she had the power and stuff. So I think, I'm assuming that she's going to get the power like Corey eventually. She's going to get that power or she has it in her and somehow it's going to come out. But I like that actress who's playing uh, <laughs> the sister. They went a different way than I thought they were going to go with her by actually having her hang out in the, with the Titans and stuff so that's really good and you got to see them investigate we see got to actually got to see them actually do investigation as titans and we got you know we got to see barbara and uh i mean dick and cory go to you know investigate that little bit and he, and he actually met blackfire <laughs> and we got to see again that oh god what do you call the lady lady shiva or something that's what he called her that assassin she was real brutal and we see that there's little cracks in the armor with um Jonathan Crane and um, and Jason Todd because he yeah he was he wanted him to explain the plan he, he was and Crane was telling him to wait we gotta produce more of this this drug and stuff but he didn't want to wait <laughs> and he and and basically Jonathan talked him to see Lady Shiver in action and let him know that you know calm down young Padawan you know in case you don't want to follow the plan I got a backup person right here but then you see at the end Jason did not give a crap he stole the he stole the drugs that they had anyway and, and put out put it on the street and they have to you know one of those people that took the drugs went to tim drake's parents restaurant and shot i think his dad <laughs> so i'm definitely we got to see tim drake again so i'm definitely interested in seeing you know how he figures into the story eventually you know eventually he's gonna you know meet batman because i know in the comics he figures out who batman and bruce bruce wayne is he figures that out because he's that smart so i wonder if they'll he'll do that again in this and Maybe, you know, actually go to Wayne Manor, show up at Wayne Manor and stuff. Because we know Bruce is supposed to be coming back. And see, I like Lady Shipper. She used that Bruce's voice to lure, <laughs> you know, lure uh, Barbara out there. But thank God. Like, and we did see her in one of the behind scenes uh, videos of her uh, training with those, uh, with the uh, with the stuntman. I think in a behind the scenes video of her uh Savannah Welch practicing with those two katana sticks, and we got to see her use use that in this episode, which is cool. Okay, and I like that they did the name drop of Oracle, 
that, you know, they use it, they say, I guess it's a computer system, and, you know, Barbara didn't want to give Dick access to it, so Dick actually broke in with the help of Gar and actually brought it to the Batcave, and you got to see Ryan Potter use his sword skills, because you know he knows, he's a master, I think, he got a couple of black belts, I think Ryan Potter does, so you got to see him do a little sword play and stuff <laughs> in the Batmobile, but that's, again, again, this show is, uh, again, I think the writing is good, at least, I'm just interested in seeing how they, you know, the Titans, and again, I like, uh, Starfire, Corey yelling at Dick saying, and Gar yelling at him saying, stop going at it alone. Okay, you know, again, you gotta, you know, do it as a team. We're a team, we're a family. So we should be doing this as together. And, and they, and they, this episode, they actually act like a team. They actually investigated and, and went to see things as a team. And we got to see Superboy actually save someone this time, which I think was uh, cool to see, especially after the fiasco with Hank. But I don't know how, there's no, coming back for uh, I know uh, Gar was asking Dick are we going to kill kill Jason but I don't know how you're going to even if that that uh, spray that he was using to manipulate him I don't know how he could come back because still Hank is dead at the end of the day Hank is dead and Jason was ultimately responsible even if you're going to say he's under the influence of that drug and that, that excuse him for killing all the people that he's killed I don't know. That, that's going to be a hard road to try to, you know, forget, forgive that. I don't know how you're going to, you know, forgive that because he killed, he's killed a lot of people. Okay, and and that more probably he killed one of the Titans, and so I don't know how that's going to go. But but you know, unless he makes some self sacking, maybe he'll make some self sac sacrifice towards the end of the season because I don't know how else you're going to forgive him because he, you know, he killed Hank. He blew up Hank. Well, they're going to say, well, he was under the influence of Jonathan Crane's that, that uh, I guess not fear gas, but I guess brave gas or courage gas, or whatever they want to call it, that they want to actually mass produce. Okay. And like I said, and I'm interested in seeing how Jonathan Crane is going to react to uh, Red Hood going off message, even though he was warned and he went off message anyway and released it, gave it to some local thugs and they went about using it. So I wonder how he's going to, you know, Jonathan Crane is going to, uh, going to react to that. It's, you know, it's very interesting. I'm definitely, I'm definitely interested in seeing where this goes after this, and I'm, I'm just wondering where, when we're gonna visit, I guess Donna and Raven on Paradise Island. I guess I'm assuming that's coming up in one of these episodes. So definitely interested in seeing how, and then how they come back into it with the Titans, and definitely how Tim Drake meets. Because I know, like I said in the comics, he he figures out that Bruce Wayne is Batman. So I wonder if he's gonna do the same thing on this show, and then actually show up towards the end of the season. At me and Wayne Manor. Okay, wanting to be the next Robin, and I, but I think that'll be after Bruce comes back and 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 decides to continue to be Batman and whatever. Okay, but we'll see how this plays out. Again, like I said, I don't know how you can redeem uh, Jason Todd because because I'm sorry he he killed Hank. That's a pretty big hurdle to try to overcome, even with the mind relation. I don't see how that's going to be overcome. Anyway, um, let me know what you think of this episode, episode six of Titan season three. Uh, episode 6, what do you think of it? Uh, feel free to leave comments down below and let me know what you think. Um, also, I have links to my uh, Facebook, my Twitter, my Instagram. Also, I have a link to my other channel, Bob Views and Opinions. Please check that out as well. Also, I want to say a, a link down below to my patron. Again, I want to say a special thank you to my patron. His name will appear in this video somewhere. I want to say thank you to him for supporting me. And again, my patron is only $5 a month. Tons of content on there. Tons of TV show reactions. I got Titans Season 3 on there. I got uh, Stargirl Season 2 on there. I got uh, Stargirl Season 1 on there. I got The Mandalorian Season 2, The Boys Season 2, WandaVision. I got Loki on there. I got Zack Snyder's Justice League, all four parts on there. Again, all these are unedited reactions to it. Okay, so if you want to check it out, again, it's only $5 a month. Tons of content on there. Please check it out as well. Again, if you want to support me, follow the link to my patron. And this is Trey Pass saying so long and take care.